Other news tonight, shots fired on Father's Day. Law enforcement responding to multiple shootings across Bear County today. That's right. That includes two new shootings happening just hours ago on the northeast side. We begin on the east side. San Antonio police say an argument between a man and woman ended with the man being shot around 1.30 this morning. It happened on North New Braunfels at the East Bar. Police say the woman allegedly pulled a gun out and shot the man in the back before fleeing. The victim was transported to University Hospital with life-threatening injuries. The suspect still at large. Fast forward to this evening when two separate shootings happened within a single hour, both happening on the northeast side of the county. The first on Chipping. That's where Bear County deputies say a suspect shot at a vehicle with people, including a small child, inside. That vehicle driving to the HEB on Walsham Road in Montgomery, where they then called police for help. No injuries were reported. Deputies are still searching for the suspects. Shortly after that call rang out, San Antonio police arrived at Shorthorn. They say the victim in this shooting showed up to the suspect's home to collect a debt. Right now it's unclear what kind of debt it was for, uh, but apparently there's individuals coming and going according to witnesses at all times. It was during that interaction the suspect claims the victim brandished a machete. The shooter was found inside with a, with a wound to the chest, looked like a knife wound or stab wound. The suspect told police it was that injury which caused him to shoot the victim multiple times in the chest to defend himself. Both the shooting victim and the shooter were hospitalized. Detectives are investigating. It is unclear if any charges will be filed. And if you have any information that can help investigators with any of these shootings, you are urged to call police immediately. Coming up at 1030, more on a high number of shootings happening across the nation this Father's Day weekend. We also have an update tonight on a